for those who may not know me, my name is Jessica White and I am the Northwest Lead Speech and Language Therapist for Kettleston Group. I would like to warmly welcome you today to our brand new web series, A Pinch of Salt. Each week, a member of our experienced and passionate speech and language team will be here to give you top tips, strategies, ideas for fun games and reflective activities that can all help to support the speech, language and communication development of young people. Whether you are a parent of a pupil who attends one of our specialist provisions, a member of staff or just someone looking for some speech, language and communication advice, then this bite-sized information web series can help you to create the communication friendly environment which we know is essential to support the well-being learning and social emotional development of our young people. Thank you. So let's get started. Older primary and secondary age pupils with immature language development can often experience difficulties with auditory memory. And essentially, this means that sometimes it may be difficult for them to remember things that people say. Now there's a really quick and easy fun game that you can play to support them to develop these auditory memory skills and it's called I went to. Now if you are a parent this is something you can play really quickly in the car next time you're together and you can base it on your own child's interests. So for example if you have a child who is interested in football the game would go something like this. You would start and say I went to a football match and bought a pie. Your child takes the next turn and would say something like, I went to a football match and bought a scarf and a pie. And so the game goes on. If you want to increase the difficulty of the game, you can move from words to phrases. So you could play something like, I went to the cinema and saw X, Y, Z. Or, I went to the library and borrowed Harry Potter and the Goblet of Fire. And so it continues. If you are a teacher, this is something that you can use easily as a starter activity. And you can use it to help reinforce that topic vocabulary. So if you are, for example, a history teacher and your current topic is ancient Egyptians, you could play... I went to an ancient Egyptian pyramid and saw hieroglyphics. Now, I would like everyone watching this to have a go at playing this game this week with a young person or a group of young people. And I'd love to know how you all get on. You can send me your feedback and any questions that you may have to j.white at kettlestongroup.com. Thank you and I look forward to seeing you next week.